What's up, guys? Jamie Grace here. This is Erin Collins. What up? I'm Jamie Grace Collins, by the way, for those of you guys that do not know. This is Isabella. She is uh, she okay. is sleeping. Well, she's not sleeping, sorry. She's eating. And she's yes, going to sleep on this For bottle. those of you guys that are very passionate yeah. about color swatches and stuff like that, I know that these two things don't match. But she's really cute in little bedtime hats. I'm colorblind, so, so who she's cares? wearing one <laughs> anyway. Um, but we are doing a part two to our love story. We did a part one a couple weeks ago. Yeah. Like the real story of how we met. We shared the story all over the place. Many interviews and YouTube videos and that kind of stuff. Um, but we've never really just like sat down and told the whole thing unedited. And so this is like and part still two like of that everybody story. doesn't know because I feel like for, I feel like we're always telling this story to people and yeah. friends. And it's like, it's so, yeah. cool. Which is like, okay. I'm not know. expecting anybody to know our story. Right, right, right. But we'll have people that like will say things to us like, I watch your YouTube videos. Like, oh my gosh, so how'd you use me? And I'm like, <laughs> ah, that's a good one. Like, either yeah, do you yeah. not really watch them or do you really just want more of the story? Yeah. So, this is the part two to the story. If you haven't seen part one, right. make sure you go watch go it. Go back. It'll be in the um, link right down below. Yeah. Yeah, I was about <laughs> to say, right down, be right down below. So also, like, well, I'm oh, sorry, what were you going to say? No, I was just going to jump right into it, my bad. And she <laughs> wants to throw that. I was just going to say, if it's anything yeah. like the part one that we did, we were also really tired because we oh. also had a long drive today yeah. and a lot of busy had stuff. Had a birthday party. It was really yeah. great, yeah. but we're also really tired. So sorry if we, if we seem, we're not sorry if we seem loopy, that's just who I we are. <laughs> anyway, so we're Carry jumping on. back into it. So, uh, yeah, so it was the video. It didn't send. Yeah. So I'm like, oh, Lord, this video ain't sent. And so I was trying to send the video, then the number. So the only thing that sent was the number. Yeah. No, no, no. She, no, we're at the point where, yeah. So no, that was right. Yeah, that was totally right. So <laughs> with that, I noticed she didn't text. She didn't text me back. Cause I thought the video. Well, had, I didn't DM you back. Yeah, she didn't DM me, DM me back, and so I'm like, "Yo, like it's been a minute." So I'm like, "Did you get the video?" She's like, "No, I didn't get." There was a video. I'm yeah. like, "Oh lord." So on my end, I'm sitting at home, about to go to Disneyland. This is my 26th birth, 26th birthday, and I'm sitting with my sister and my friend Kristen, and I just get a DM from Aaron, and I'm freaking out because I'm like falling in love with this guy already, and. It's literally just, it's the morning of my birthday, and I literally wake up to a DM with just his phone number in it. And I was just like, that is the most arrogant, disrespectful thing that a guy could do. I would do. never do anything like yeah. that. She, I, I like, hope. I I felt like it was out of character Good. for him. Good. But at the same time, you know how like Good. when you like kind of like someone and then you're sitting around with all your friends and you might like send a risky text, you know, that all your friends encourage you to send. I felt like I was like, oh, no, I wonder if his buddies like encouraged him to just no, send that the wasn't, number. No, that wasn't the case. Yeah. At all. Yeah. And then so I like, once I, I didn't found know, out. But I was like, sorry, I was uh, just mad. I was uh, like, uh, I'm bad. never talking to this guy again. Just send me your phone number. Who do you think you are? What kind of birthday present is this? Because I was expecting like a good morning, happy birthday. I hope it's great. At least. Two periods and an exclamation it, point. I it technically did, but it just didn't send. So with that, it didn't send. And I'm in Chicago, like on the what they call the Magnificent Mile or whatever and whatnot. So, yeah, I got bags. It's like Black Friday. I'm still shopping. It's morning. And I'm like, uh-oh, I need to find some Wi-Fi. My phone data sucks. I need to do this video over. So I'm like, okay, Starbucks, they have Wi-Fi. So I'm literally booking it to the nearest Starbucks because they're all over. But it's like this one was super far away. So I'm running. It's a bunch of people on the Magnificent Mile in Chicago. And I'm like, booking it. Huh, 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 huh. And I finally got to Starbucks. And I practiced the video maybe <laughs> five times. He practiced it because he had a crush on and yeah, it was a dad and his son like staring at me like the whole time doing it. And uh, Sorry. yeah, and then after that, uh, yeah, I sent it and yeah, I guess it was good, right? Yeah, so I, again, I'm over here beefy. thinking that he's like the, oops, I'm over here thinking that he's like the most terrible guy on the planet. Um, and so we're about to head to Disneyland. So we just like hop in the car and I'm just like, whatever, I don't need him anyway, which honestly in the back of my mind, I was like, man, I really loved him. But how come that's so, you know, knowing that he would send a text like that. Um, my sister told me to text him like get or send a DM like that. My sister told me to text him and say who this, which is just like the most petty thing to do. Cause obviously I know who it is cause he DM'd me his number, but she just wanted me to be petty. Anyways, I didn't do that. We got in the car and, uh, yeah. And I think we got in the car and that's when I got the message that said, 
did you get the video? Because he saw that she's really sweet. Good job, Bill. She's, he saw that I was reading the messages on Instagram and he was like, did you get it? And I was like, wait, there was a video. And then all I was hoping is that he would send me a video before I got to Disneyland because my parents were dropping us off and I'm really close to my parents, especially, well, both my parents, but I knew that I wanted to show my mom if it was like really like cute. Uh, if it was like embarrassing and awkward, I was gonna be like, never mind. Um, but I was like, I knew I wanted to show my mom. So he sent me this happy birthday video. You guys, when I tell you I was done, I already knew I was falling in love with him. When I saw that video, I was like, I have to marry this man. He is so cute. Those dimples and that cap. He was wearing this cap. Oh my gosh. That cute Oh, face. I was. Anyway, yeah. so he sent me this video that was like, hey, you. Jamie, um, I really enjoy getting to know you these last couple of days, and um, it was cool with you. I like to get on the phone and like get to know you better. Um, okay, bye. It was so cute. So he sent me that. Are you getting embarrassed right now? No, no, no. I was, oh, I was worrying about because she was like, uh, Oh, come sit with me. You want to sit with mommy? You want to sit with daddy? Yeah, she's trying to go oh, back to sleep. Oh, you're going back? Okay, yeah, good night. Yeah. By the way, if you've watched any of our videos before with her, then y'all know how normal this is for Bella to just fall asleep while we're talking at normal to loud volume. It's it's very fascinating. Um, but yeah, so he sent me this video, or he, I saw the video, and then I, I showed Kristen, and then I showed my mom, and then I showed Morgan, oh, and God. my mom, I am <laughs> so funny. Right, now, get to the part where you made the video. My video was remarkable, because all I remember is my mom saying, uh, my mom was like, oh, who's this? And my sister was like, he's tall. That was the only thing. And my mom was like, okay, okay. So then we get to Disneyland, and I think I kept saying Disney World all that time. We get to Disneyland and we're walking around the park and I know that I have to send him a video back. I didn't have to, but I wanted to send him a video back. And so um, I was, I'll tell you what I did and then I'll give you the backstory because I know Aaron wants to give his commentary on my video. So I sent him this video that was just like, hey Aaron, um, I'd like to get to know you better too. Uh, you know, it's been great getting to talk to you, but just so you know, um, I don't text like that. So if you want to talk, um, you can call or FaceTime. And that was just a boundary that I set up early on in my singlehood. I was not about to be up late at night texting someone for days, weeks, months at a time. Because my thing was, you could be texting a bunch of other girls. I would like, yeah, if we're actually supposed to be getting to know each other, I would like to have your full attention, please. Uh, if not, then bye. In I, my I eyes, eating a sandwich. that video, like she was not smiling. Uh, she was very straight fit. <laughs> She doesn't want to go to sleep. Sorry, took us a quick break there. But um, where were we? Yeah, so she yeah, literally said, wasn't, I, smiling. wasn't smiling. She wasn't it, smiling. Yeah. She wasn't like, like it just was like very like, yeah, it's in my eyes like, yeah, sure, I'll do it. I mean, I guess, I guess. It didn't, she didn't seem very interested. I honestly just felt like she just felt sorry for me. <laughs> I was like, oh man, dang it's so it. funny because I was so like too in me. Yeah, I was like, oh my gosh, Aaron, Aaron, oh my gosh, yeah. Aaron. And then like, I don't know what it was. I think when I got back to, when I got back to uh, St. Louis, I think. Yeah, is that when we talked? Yeah, yeah, it's when we I, talk, I. Well, we talked the next day. And just backstory on my video. So when yeah, that's, I yeah, I went back. I got back to St. Louis. Yeah. When I filmed that video for Aaron. I had had a pretty like rough half hour. Like I was so nervous trying to figure out what to say, and then I was gonna go get on Indiana Jones and my friends and my family. Um, but I am terrified of roller coasters, and I don't like the dark, and I'm a little bit claustrophobic. So we had just gotten in line for Indiana Jones. It was scary. I had a near panic attack. I ended up not getting on Indiana Jones because I was so scared that I was by myself alone in that big old park out in California. Okay. Just a Georgia girl with nowhere to go. And basically, I was just terrified. So when I made him that video, that was after all of that. And I was just, I think in my head, I thought I was way more enthusiastic. But then also, I was trying to like, you know, I was trying to like not be all like, oh my gosh, Aaron. I mean, clearly it worked. It worked. It worked. <laughs> but then overall, out. yeah, I think, yeah, that, but, that was this you know, Friday. Uh, yeah. That, that was, Friday. That was I went, Friday. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I went back home and then we, yeah, we pretty much talked on the phone for yeah. like a good, yeah, we talked on the phone for about a good three hours and pretty much, you know, like, I felt like from there, like, it was like, it was, it was history from there. But like, yeah. just to fast forward a little bit, I think to, 
Well, I think people, because I know people ask me this a lot. I do want to fast forward. But I think people, I know people ask me a lot, what did we talk about on that first phone call? I think, I think some people are surprised of how intentional we both were. Oh, well, oh. Yeah. Because, I mean, within 15, 20 minutes, like, I was, <laughs> we were like, like, triple, triple checking. You single? How long you been single? You plan to be single yeah, forever? Yeah, I think. Like, I've, we were, like, very, like. My, I my main three things that uh, I had to, like, get out there was, like, yo, like, I'm looking for a wife, not a girlfriend. Um, oh, it's been a minute. It, it was, was, it was kids. You wanted to know yeah, if I wanted to have yeah, kids. Yeah, if you wanted to have kids. And you asked me how many, Aaron asked me how many yeah. kids I wanted to have on that first phone call. Yeah. Which to some people that could scare them away and that's okay because it's like, if that's not what you want, then good. Now you know that that person and you don't have the same desires or you and that person. But for me, that was like the most attractive question he could ask because- yeah. I love kids, and I wanted to have kids very early in my marriage, and we did. So I'm really glad that we were able to talk about those really vulnerable things. Yeah, mm-hmm. we talked about our biggest fears, biggest fears, and our just... favorite foods, favorite movies, TV yeah. shows. I found out he liked Gotham, like all these like scary, mm-hmm. like fun superhero stuff. shows. Uh, yeah, so we, got, we, we talked about the fun. We stuff. We got fun stuff. Got really deep on some other stuff, but like I think yeah, those are some of the main things we talked about, and just yeah. like. Another one was mine, was just like not keeping each other guessing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know, I don't want to like ever leave her wondering like what I'm thinking or what I meant by something. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I just want to be straightforward and keep it 100 with you so you're not guessing, so you're not having all these assumptions, you know, going around your yeah. head when we're off the phone. I want to make everything like crystal clear yeah. when I'm talking to you and just with everything. And uh, I think another one was just uh, show, uh, not showing your feelings, but you know, telling me your feelings. If that makes any sense. So, like, in a sense, like, I don't want you to show me that you're mad by, like, not texting me or, like, texting me real short. Remember, be like, or just tell me, like, yo, like, this really hurt my feelings. Just tell, tell me how, to, how how you felt instead of just, like, showing me in your actions and, like, having me guess, like, yo, was it this? Was right. it that? And I guess that kind of ties back into, you know, the whole, like, not keeping you guessing. Thing. Yeah. So, well, the, yeah. I mean, it was communication. Yeah, like, just, it's just, just it's communication. But, yeah, just that's kind know, of broken down in my head. So. Yeah, people always want to know, like, how did... That was really good for you. But people always are like, how did it happen so fast? And it's like, even if you do all the stuff that we did, like, it may not happen that fast. Like, it's not about, like, oh, trying to, yeah. you know, get the timeline that somebody else did. Mm-hmm. We never, and just, and just for those of you that can't see the baby, I am still rocking here. I'm not just, like, you know, yeah. uh, emotionally she the bank yeah, now she's just like Yeah, she is sleep, sleep. Um, but, yeah, I mean, it, it's just, it's just how, it's just Sorry, how guys. it worked for Aaron and I. Like, and we were just very intentional with literally every conversation like that was our first conversation and then our second conversation I mean, we kept it it, w- it was everything it wasn't just all like what are your spiritual beliefs on you know in thessalonians like it wasn't all that kind of stuff it was some serious stuff but it was also i mean we also talked about i remember one specific thing he asked me like a week in he was like oh i have a deal breaker i don't know if you remember this and i was like mm-hmm. what's your deal breaker and he was like i need to know how do you get toothpaste out of the tub, out of the tube? Oh my gosh, I forgot. Because you're like you're like I cannot marry someone. <laughs> like you know, it was just we talked about oh, yeah, that like kind of stuff, stuff too, yeah. which I think was part of what made it cool for long distance is that we had to go into so much detail about stuff. Yeah. It was like okay, when you watch a movie, you make the popcorn before or in the middle. Like oh, everything gosh. was like so specific. Um, but in a good way, not a creepy way. Yeah. We just we just wanted to talk to each other about everything and involve each other in every part of our lives. And so um, we talked. That was November 26th, the first day we talked, the day uh, after my birthday, which, crazy enough, my birthday's coming up this Monday, so that's about to be two years since all this happened. Um, and then by the 27th, 28th, 29th, I mean... By what your mom, your mom's birthday is December seventh. By December seventh, I was sending his mom a birthday video. So I think we were pretty. Like, uh, I, I'm not gonna imitate. Yeah, he it. always she imitates me, I and that. I don't think it's she, funny she at all. She hates it. She hates cause... it. So I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> I mean, I was like, I was like, yeah, I was like really trying to get her to like me. I was just, I was just like, okay, be the most <laughs> dignified. By the way, my mom was thinking, loved it. <laughs> I was just trying to be the most dignified I could be. Yeah. I was like, don't crack any jokes. Mm-hmm. Don't be weird. Yeah. Just be normal, which is really hard. Oh for me. snap! I was thinking about it. Did we? Uh, did you want to include the just like? Well, that's how we met. What? Did you want to go into like? Oh, how like how I ended up like moving out here? 
Oh, what are we going to say that for next time? I think we're at like 13, 14 minutes already. Yeah, so let's, yeah. Let's say that for next time? Yeah. So yeah, so let's just go, let's just go all the way up until January. So we talked all through Thanksgiving, we talked all through December. Yeah. We talked, did we? Oh yeah, it got a little, it got a little quiet in late December. It got very quiet, honestly. uh, Maybe, maybe we should save that for next time because that... Yeah it, yeah, it got a little quiet, but uh, I think we'll uh, we'll leave it right there. Yeah. Because that's like a whole thing in itself. That is a whole, <laughs> whole Not going to get story. too deep on it, but yeah. I'll just keep my mouth shut on that. But yeah, I'll tell you how it came Can I give back. a teaser? Go ahead. We got to the point where we had to figure out if we were actually going to be committed to each other or if we were just going to walk away completely and just give up. Is that a fair teaser? Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> Okay, so that was our Christmas two years ago. Um, clearly, it'll be different this year, so happy ending. But, you know, we haven't shared all these details yeah. before. So, if you're getting them for the first time on our YouTube channel, hey, hey, thanks hey. for listening, guys. Yeah. For watching. Mm -hmm. um, and, yeah, just thanks so much for loving on this YouTube channel. We love making videos for y'all. Love, peace, and chicken grease. Ooh, y'all air made some chicken wings the other night. Okay. It was so good. We out. Love you guys.